Hello, this is Martin Daubney from Inspire Coaching in Basel, and I'm here on day 11 of the 12 days. 12 tools of, from HeartMath for uh, stillness and a more balanced life, stress-free. Today, we are actually looking at patience, not the card game where you play by yourself, but how to build the capacity to be more patient, not only with others, but maybe with ourselves as well. Anyone who's ever driven a car and been stuck in traffic and felt they might be being late for a, a meeting can start to feel those feelings of being impatient. Anyone who's tried to explain maths the way it was taught to you as a child to a young adult in your family who's been taught it a different way and getting frustrated with the situation maybe could have learned from having this tool back then. I apologise. These things happen. So patience. The first thing to do is to be aware, be self-aware and self-knowing that what that feeling you're having is impatience. Without that awareness, it's very difficult to stop it. But it's very, once you know that that's impatience brewing up in you, you can check it and go, aha, thank you, impatience, you've shown up again. Now I need to slow down. And it is simply a matter of taking the breath and breathing in through the heart and out through the heart and getting yourself into a state of ease and patience that will allow you to actually start to open up and hear those things that need to be heard and see those things that need to be seen so that you can get a greater understanding of what's going on and forgive yourself for not being as patient as you may have been. It is a bit of a virtue, I know, patience of a saint and all that, but it is also one of those tools and techniques that can help manage blood pressure in the best possible way. I encourage you to give it a go. Number 11, patience. And uh, in the meantime, do keep well and hopefully see you back here for day 12 tomorrow.